Good morning, Hawaii, and welcome back. The time now is 619, and it's time now for today's Social Wire. Now, before you get to work this morning, well, we found something that may help you relax. Come break time, Yasmin is back with a look at what's buzzing, and it's really strange. It is, Mahia, and you know, this product just might become more popular than the Snuggie. Why? Probably because not only is it actually useful, but it looks absolutely ridiculous. Designed by the company Kawamura Ganjavian, this soft head pillow allows you to stick your head and hands in it when you need that quick power nap at work. The company calls it the ostrich. And it is described as a micro environment where you can take a warm and comfortable power nap. It's neither a pillow, nor a cushion, nor a bed, nor a garment, but a bit of each at the same time. It's like a cave for your head and hands, isolating them for a few minutes without you ever having to leave your desk. I kind of want to try it out, actually, Maya, but how do you breathe in that thing? No word yet on when these will actually be available for purchase. Well, halftime shows are usually filled with dancers and cheerleaders doing a little number or a band putting on a performance. But this past weekend, it was a mascot who gave an explosive show. Check out this viral video. The mascot of the Indiana Pacers was in town to put on a halftime show when he dunked. And it, quite a show it was. Take a look at that again. We're going to be replaying that video. The fur yellow and blue creature named Boomer gained a lot of fans this past Saturday night when his first dunk completely shattered the backboard. Boom! Right there. Bringing down the rim and all the glass and appropriately the house in the process. With only one usable hoop left, the game had to be moved to another gym. Mahe Alani, that's a look at what's trending on KITV for Social Wire. Wow. I'm so amazed he didn't get injured because that's a pretty fantastic flip he did there. That was incredible. Or even the cheerleaders who were at the bottom out there. So mm -hmm. I don't think that they, I'm sure they planned it out before that. They had a little practice runs, but they weren't expecting that thing to shower. Wow. And I certainly wasn't expecting to see an ostrich this morning as well. No. But you got to buy it, yes, me. That was bizarre. I think we should, just for kicks and giggles. <laughs> Take a look at this again. <laughs> You know, I think Felix would appreciate this. Uh, <laughs> I think we director. all could appreciate it. <laughs> it's actually pretty cool looking. All right, was traffic sleepy this morning, Yasmin? Oh, not at all, Mahela. It was sleepy a little earlier, but it's definitely getting a lot busier. Picking up pace and, of course, building in volume out from the west side. Travel time's in from Mililani, about 41 minutes out there. So looking pretty decent in from Pearl City, 34 minutes. And as we take a live look at those cameras, coming in through the H1 